Yo, today we're gonna be taking a beat that sounds like this. Yeah. And turning it into this. Yo, what's up with y'all? It's your boy TV Digital. Welcome back to another tutorial. You know what I'm saying? Today we're gonna be collabing on the subscribers FLP. If you don't know, I have a Patreon. Basically, my Patreon is where I drop advanced tutorials, one-on-one -on -one sessions, group sessions, and exclusive kits. So what I did today is I linked up with the producer Wimbo who signed up for my one-on-one -on -one sessions and he had a beat that kind of needed some work on. And you know what I'm saying? We're gonna make that joint hard. So today we're gonna be going over how to make your melody stronger, sound selection, arrangement, and a little bit of mixing. This is the full FLP studio dummy course we're going over everything today so you know what i'm saying make sure you sit back enjoy the tutorial and also make sure you like comment and subscribe Stuff that was weak on it was the arrangement the thing is sound selection so what we're gonna do is we're gonna chop this one by one um, starting with the piano melody you can use keyscape keyscape is a vst full of um, pianos another joint that you can use which is really good is called piano v2 now this is by a tour plugin now if you don't want to spend the money on the bundle then the option that you have is you could rent splice has rent to own plugins so i actually pay like 20 dollars a month for the whole a tour collection do is we're gonna take this down another octave okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna just strum it strum this a little bit And just me playing with the timing, it's just making it sound more realistic, you know what I'm saying? Why are you being so loud? Oh! Oh! <laughs> Use Piano V2 by Tour. Alright, so now what we're gonna do is just hit Alt R and we're just gonna randomize the panning a little bit and just with a little bit with the velocity. Let's put a little bit of RC20 on this. All right, so that's hard. Now we're gonna throw this bass line in there. I ain't gonna lie, the bass line perfect. I don't even wanna touch that. Let me see what joint you use, full finger bass. So you already know the game. Now what we could do is add a couple sounds. So what we're gonna go ahead and add is, we go to my one shot, my digital instrument one shot kit. Every hundred cent um on the pitch is basically a semitone. So. It's a little dry, so we'll just throw a little bit of reverb. And then what you want to do is you want to put it on the reverse. And that right there is real simple. So we just keep it like that. Probably pitch it up an octave to see how it sounds. Now you could use arcade and get vocal chops, but I think it was arcade, there's only so many banks, everybody using it. 
with Splice, you really have like on a thousand page search bar full of vocals. So I already know that we in D minor. We are in the BPM 150. So I'm gonna take everything from like 116 and up. So that way when we stretch it, it, it doesn't sound as robotic. So that's hard. We can just take that. And then what I like to do is, we know we at 150. I'm going to just put this down to 125 real quick just to see how many bars this is actually. So we know this is eight bars and put it back up to 150. And then now we'll just stretch it to eight bars so it can match. Sometimes they have that export the loop like this. So I just put it in the right BPM so I can know exactly how many bars it is. And Splice tells you the BPM right here. And then we're just going to put it on stretch. And what we could do is, let's reverse this. One thing I like to do is I, I like to use a soft clipper. Boom. When you're making beats, you ain't got to do too much mixing. So now we're just going to find a couple sounds. So we're just going to use. This what helps me arrange beats so much better. We finna take ride wave acapellas. It's gonna be off key, so we just gotta get it on key. Heart been broke so many times. Heart been broke so many times. Don't know what to believe. Now, the reason why the acapellas are in there, cause now it's gonna help us arrange it to like an actual record. You get one you get why yeah. I put the acapellas in there? So yeah, now that's, I'm a yeah, that's cool. Man. I never thought of that, man. <laughs> Now, so so what we have here, we have a 16 um 16 bar intro, which is kind of long, but I mean this is an emotional song. So we got a 16 bar intro, and your hook is gonna consist of 16 bars. What I like to do for my hook is I don't want all my drums to come in at the same time. So we're gonna take this kick out. We could take this snare out, and let's take we could take the drums out right here and just have the 808. <laughs> And then we're gonna do the same thing. The verse is about to come in. So what I'm gonna do for the verses, I'm gonna take the drums out a little bit. Yeah, yeah that's hard. Then we take the little clap joint right here. Dun, dun, dun. So for the verse, let's take out some of these instruments. Make a transition so we can know we about to go into the hook. So what we'll do is halfway through, let's take some of these drums out. And what we do is we add these transitions back into here so we can add that we could add this little joint that we put right here and whatever that switch is Yeah, 
Yeah. yeah, so that's that's really what I do. That's a, but you got a whole hour of private tutorial. <laughs> yeah. Right, yeah, you got the sauce. Yeah, so it's a sound selection, learning how to arrange it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So on a scale of one to ten, how helpful this was? No, I mean I say right now it's a ten because <laughs> I'm gonna send this back to you so you can have the sounds. Yeah, I was just sending it back because I want to study that, man. I want to see. Yeah, because I feel like just those little things, like sound selection, the arrangement. Like once I get that down, I feel like I'll be straight. Hey man, that's it. Hope y'all like this video. Um, thank you for staying and watching towards the end. If you want to sign up for my Patreon, the link is in the description. It's patreon.com slash TV game. I have three memberships. I have a head ass first class, second class, and third class. The lowest one is $10 a month, and the highest one goes to $50 a month. So make sure you go check it out. You know what I'm saying? You see the benefits. He said 10 out of 10. You dig what I'm saying? Also, most of the drums that you've seen in this tutorial comes from YB New Pipe em Up Kit. If you want that kit, make sure you sign up below using my link. But besides that, man, I will see y'all Sunday. Yeah, I think that's uh I think that's it. I gotta go. TV just went digital.